Hello friends, this is Durga from ITVarsity. As part of setting up development environment on Mac uh, for big data, as part of this video, I will try to show how to use uh, uh, VMware Fusion or how to install VMware Fusion on Mac. Okay. So to start, just go to Google and search for VMware Fusion for Mac. It will provide uh, uh, different links. Click on download VMware Fusion 8, my VMware and then you can click on get free trial to start with once you click on uh, uh, free trial you can click on this icon download vmware fusion 8 and uh, it will take some time it has 363 mb and once it is downloaded we we will see what needs to be done uh, with this software it is very straightforward to install you just have to download it downloads uh, with the DMG extension on Mac. You just have to double click and you can actually uh, install it. So we will see once the installation is done. So VMware Fusion download is done. So we can see here. And once it is done, you can uh, double click. And then uh, it will install. It's already there on my Mac. So uh, you will see uh, already existing virtual machines on, on my installation. Okay, here you have to give the login password for your laptop to permit uh, the installation uh, to be complete. Okay, so I already have the software. I just uh, replaced uh, with uh, the latest version. And you can see um, a few VMs which are already created. For you, it will be empty. And then you can actually start setting up the virtual machine. If you, if you click on this, you will get the license. So, um, and then you will be able to uh, uh, enter the license over there. And, uh, and then it will start working with the license. Okay. And that being said, it's very straightforward to install VMware Fusion and if you can see here, you can actually get all the virtual machines that are uh, set up on, on, the, um, on, on the Mac uh, here. You can set up as many VMs uh, the, the system can support, but you will be able to run only one or two VMs at a given point in time. Uh, it, it all depends upon how much memory you are trying to give uh, to these VMs. For both Cloudera Quick Start as well as Hortonworks Sandbox, you have to give 8 to 10 GB RAM. So hardly you can uh, have any more VM on that. But if you want to use for other purposes, you can actually set up multiple nodes, three nodes, four nodes, or five nodes, and have all of them up and running at a, at a given point in time uh, to explore uh, many other technologies, including a multi-node cluster of Hadoop uh, on, the, uh, on the laptop. So the VMware Fusion, can come handy in many ways okay that being said i hope you're enjoying the content if you like the video please uh, provide the feedback so that i can uh, uh, improvise on my content in future that being said thank you bye